Well, the stimulus money is coming, but that won't be an instant relief in the, to the economic crisis we're in. Consumer investigator Steve Sprasia looks at what it'll take to get this country back to a sound economy again. The money from the stimulus checks is a windfall, but a windfall being delivered electronically, mostly by direct deposit. And it's not going to be taxable. Those are the checks that people, that most people will get. Now some folks are wondering, can you track the money to see when it'll come your way? Well, since the IRS is handling distribution, it says it expects to create an online portal in late April or early May, which will enable taxpayers to not only update their direct deposit information, but also check on the status of their stimulus check. If you own a small business, your stimulus money is in the form of a loan, which carries a 1% interest rate. But NC State economist Michael Walden tells me, under certain circumstances, you won't have to pay off that loan. If 75% of uh, that loan is ultimately used for payroll, paying workers, that loan will turn into a grant. Despite the ongoing pandemic news, the stock market is showing signs of recovery. Here's why. The stock market's not looking at today or tomorrow. They're looking months out. And they see, I think, some positive news. But for the present, Walden says, expect the virus to take its toll on the economy. We're in a three-month period here, April, May, June. That's going to be the brunt of this economically. Walden says the fact that the government acted quickly to stimulate the economy will probably keep us from experiencing a full-scale depression as we work our way through this pandemic. And long-term, Walden believes it'll probably be a year to a year and a half before we see the economy get back to where it was before COVID-19, with unemployment hovering around 3.5%. Working for you, I'm consumer investigator Steve Sprazier.